Hello Aquarians, thank you for joining me. I wanted to give you a sneaky peek at what October has in store for you. And so I've shuffled the cards off deck. Sorry, I've shuffled the cards off camera to save time. But I did want to shuffle them a little bit so you can see that I am choosing cards for you. That these have meaning for you and that I'm not just selecting what I want to read because that would be madness. All right, so I might not use these yet. It all depends if I need clarity. Give them a little shuffle just in case. Okay, so overall energy then. We've got playtime. Brilliant, Aquarius. You've got the dolphins know the importance of playing as joy creates miracles and manifestations. Yeah, keep it light, keep it bright. Lovely. For October, this is a card of celebration and playtime and good times. Um, it could even be stability and contracts. Who knows? The only reason why I'm saying that is because underneath that you've got the Eight of Pentacles and that's about work. So maybe there is a contract. We'll find out. We'll find out what's going on. So you've got the Empress, you've got the Eight of Wands and you've got the Wheel of Fortune. Fabulous. couple of Arcana cards, major Arcana cards there. So the Empress could be a significant female in your life. It could be your owning the Empress energy because we don't really work with gender in tarot. It's about the energy. So let me describe the Empress. She is abundant. She knows it. She's very successful in all that she does. She doesn't have any worries. She's wealthy. She's kind. She's gorgeous. She's usually pregnant. So... Bear that in mind. <laughs> it doesn't necessarily have to be a baby, though. It can be a new project, but it will be very successful. The Empress is a lovely and fortuitous card. The Eight of Wands is movement forward. It could even be messages, but everything's moving forward at quite a fast rate. And this is a card of luck, a stroke of good luck, everything working in your favour. It can also be a card of divine timing. So what do these cards mean then? So the playtime makes perfect sense. Have fun. Enjoy October. A lot of people do like this time of year because everybody starts to feel autumnal. Have fun with it. Maybe think about getting yourself sorted for a Halloween party or bonfire night or something like that. Because these this card can be a card of good times, celebrations, being with your friends and stability. It's really good. I love this energy for you. If this is your energy, and I think it is, everything's falling into place. You're moving forward very quickly and luck is on your side. Wow, what a great October for you, Aquarius. Let's just get one more message from the angels, please. What else can we tell Aquarius? Oh, wow, <laughs> I wish my star sign was Aquarius. You've got the Ten of Pentacles. <laughs> Wow, that is successful. That is so lovely. That is happy families. Let me just move that. This is happy families. This is um it could even be a, a money money win or what I'm trying to think of the words here. I'm getting so excited with myself. It could be a um pay rise, it could be a windfall. That was the word I was looking for. It's just if you can see you've got the whole extended family there, it's beautiful. And you've also got the stability because you've got the money, you've got the success. It's gorgeous. Absolutely wonderful. I've really enjoyed reading you. Thanks Aquarius for uh, joining me. See you next time.